Hey beloveds, welcome to an episode of Beanie TV where I offer you sprinkles of spiritual sassiness. If you are looking to deepen your self-worth, deepen your understanding of yourself, feel free to DM me and receive a free portion of my self-love e-course. DM me on Instagram at B-E-E-N-I-E TV, that's Beanie TV, and I will be happy to send you the free portion of my e-course because... I want you guys to deepen. I want you guys to love yourself. I want you guys to really, really get into who you are as a divine being. Now let's get into today's episode. Do you find yourself being suspicious of people? Do you find yourself not trusting new love that comes into your life? Do you find yourself being haunted by the past, being haunted by past situation, past conversations, past hurts? My love, that means that you are still holding on to hurts. You are still holding on to something that happened a long time ago. You are still holding on to something that God wants you to release and let go of today. If you have been led to this video, it I am just a vessel. So literally, spirit just wants you to know that you have to let it go so that you can be free. You think that you're not, you think that like your blessings aren't happening. You think you're working, working, working and things aren't happening for you. It's not because you're not working hard enough or that you're not good enough. It, it could possibly be because you have blocked energy. By holding on, you're not able to release. And when you're not able to release, your hands aren't free and you're not able to receive. Okay, when you're like this, close, like, oh my God, they hurt me so bad. They hurt me so bad. I can't do anything. I can't do anything. You're not going to receive anything. When you release, you're open. When your hands are free, you're able to receive. And you can take that analogy with you, okay? Because that was really good. But seriously, how do you release hurt? Something that I've been doing, I've been listening to Binaural Beats on YouTube and it has really helped the my brain frequency allow me to let the subconscious come forth so that I can, like my subconscious emotions, my subconscious thoughts, so that I can bring them to the surf and re surface and give them to spirit, give them to God. What does that mean practically? I will lie down, I will listen to the Binaural Beats and whatever emotions come up, I, in my mind, I realize, oh my God, I've been holding on to this from my childhood. Okay. And then I say to myself, like, I am willing to release this emotion now. I, it's not my fault. I am willing to let this go now. I am willing to let this go now. I am willing to let this go now. That is a practical way for you to let go of old hurt, old trauma, and old beliefs. And you just keep doing it. You keep doing it. The angels hear you. God hears you. So this practice is not for nothing. The spiritual realm sees you doing the work and will assist you and as days goes go on you will feel lighter you will feel better you will be on the other side of that that dense feeling those heavy feelings you're gonna be on the other side so join me in letting go of these old hurts that we've been holding on to release them in the name of jesus let them go you can don't be suspicious of people be smart be discerning don't be suspicious don't be not trusting because 10 people hurt you. There are 7.7 .7 billion people on this earth. 10 people hurt you. So now like everyone has to deal with the, the extra baggage that you're walking around with. That's not fair to yourself and that's not fair to others. Release yourself today. If you want to go deeper, like I said before, feel free to DM me on Instagram at B-E-E-N-I-E-T-V to take a free portion of my self-love e-course. And if you want more content like this, give this video a thumbs up, comment below. Um, I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. I want y'all to be lighter and healed and I want myself to be lighter and healed. Let's do the practical work, okay? Because you can't read Instagram quotes all day long, sis. You have to do the work. I love you.